Hello! The video you are about to see contains images of dolls only. They can't have my finger. No, I don't want you to numb on my finger, thank you. <laughs> no, you're not having it! Get off! It's alright, it's alright, just stay calm, it's okay. I've got to get you changed. You're ready for the day and you can have a book. Good morning, everybody. Um, I hope you had a wonderful weekend. Um, mine was actually quite relaxed for a change, not too hectic. <laughs> uh, now, I'm going to do something. Um, I found a new channel over the weekend. I don't think it's that new. It's just that it's new to me. Um, and it's a lovely lady called Shelby Reborns. I hope I've got that right. And... Um, She's, I really, really liked her channel. She's got some wonderful babies, including at least one alternative baby. And she wanted to do something called Macabre Reborn Monday, i.e. Um, use Monday to um, feature alternative babies. And I thought this was a lovely idea because I'm a bit shy of bringing out my fantasy babies because not all people like them. And I get comments on my Facebook, I get comments, and I, I shouldn't care, but I do, I'm a bit thin-skinned. So, I, you know, sh having an excuse to, um, not every Monday, but some Mondays, um, feature um, Tommy and Zori and Toby and Marcellus and anyone else I happen to get, because this is not going to be my last alternative baby. I just love them. Um, it's a great thing and I'm really excited by the idea. So we start today with Marcellus and we haven't seen Marcellus for ages as you will see because he's wearing a fleecy top. Darling, he must be roastified in this heat. Actually he feels the cold, don't you baby? So he doesn't mind too much but I am going to change him because it's really warm. This is a mayoral outfit and I can't get enough of it. And I'm also going to feed, just do a quick feed at the end. All right, babes, let's get you out of this. No, you can't knob on my hand. I'm keeping them well out of the way of your face. He doesn't hurt, he doesn't have teeth. Well, he has little ones, but... They, oh, have you got poppers? You've got pop Yes, they're at the back. Lean forward just a little bit for me. Lean forward just a little bit for me. So, um, oh, it comes right up. I'm a, such a silly mummy. That would have been so much easier to get off if I'd known that it completely unbuttons down the back. There we are, darling. You're out of that. Can I give that to you, Aunt Shirley? Of course. Um, I had such a nice weekend in lots of ways. I... I've been so disconnected from YouTube for reasons that we all know about, which I'm not even going to go into. One thing and t'other. And I've just been touching the merest of fingers with it. So, this weekend, I thought this, isn't, this will not do. I've got to do something. So I did something, and I'm a lot happier now. And I went and I watched all the videos from so many of my friends that I've missed for such a long time. And also found some new channels to look at, lovely people that I hadn't known before. Should have done that a long time ago, I shouldn't. I was feeling really intimidated. I guess that's the reason. Because I have, like, anxiety issues and I'm really thin-skinned, I was feeling really, like, intimidated and like I wanted to hide away and just do my own videos and hide. <laughs> and that's a sad state of affairs. That's all I'll say about that. That's all I've got to say about that. <laughs> Lousy Alabama accent. Right, I was going to show you, and I was too busy talking. We've got this Mickey Mouse outfit, and it's like light blue trousers 
and a white top, did you say, with the Mickey mm -hmm. on, and a, a jewel bib. You'll see it as I put it on him. So, yeah, the bear's back. <laughs> I hope. I hope. All right, baby, you're so beautiful. I should say, for those who haven't seen him before, I know zombies aren't to anyone's, everyone's taste, but I just love this little guy. Look at him. He's so cute. He doesn't have anything overtly gory or goth looking on him. He's from Twisted Beanstalk Nursery. He did have another, at least one. I think he had two mummies before me, actually. Um, but I just adore him. Look at those hands. It's so beautiful. Those are arms. So gorgeous. Um, I did reweight him because he arrived very light. That's really strange. I was watching someone over the weekend who likes babies thin and light. And I like them fat and heavy. <laughs> It's a wonderful thing about this hobby of ours. Have I got these on the right way? So, mm -hmm. Yes, I have. Um, that we all have such diverse tastes and it means we all have such differing babies. It'd be very boring to look at if the babies were all the same. So yeah, all my babies are chubby. Oh dear, I saw baby on Precious Baby last night. Oh, it was... Um, Bonnie Sieben's new baby, Shire. Oh, what a smiler. But it's coming up to Lacey and Jack's birthday. And no way, Jose. And A, I'm, this other thing is happening that I won't talk to you about yet because we're just waiting to see. But B, it's coming up to their birthdays and I'm putting all my spare money into making that work nicely um again for anyone new put this over your head my little darling um you might think it's weird to do all this falala for a, a reborn's birthday it's partly that we love to role play but it's mostly that when lacy came into our lives three years ago Mr. B over there stopped being a supportive husband and started being a reborn dad. And that's incredibly special. So it's a time that we really love to celebrate in a big way. Um, so we push all the stops, we pull all the stops out <laughs> and do something really cool, both for ourselves and for the video and for people who like to see Lacey. So yeah, um, I'm putting all my spare cash into that at the moment. So there are no numbers to crunch. No Bonnie Sieben baby for the bear. All right, oh look how cute that looks. Uh, where's his, oh here we are, here we are. Should I put this, I'll put this on you because I am gonna feed you in a minute. There we go. But baby boy looks so gorgeous, little Oscar. He weighs seven pounds fourteen. He must be a big baby. I love fat babies. Oh, look how cute that looks. Look how cute that looks. Oh, you're so beautiful. You're so beautiful. No, 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 no. You're not going to numb on me. You're not going to. Yes, I know. Oh, I haven't put your shoes on. Hold on a sec, Marcellus, my precious. Let me put your panda boots back on. There we go. One. And Marcellus has the most amazing eyes. I just adore his eyes. I can't see them, I know I can't, but I love striking eyes, the, the thought of striking eyes. And he has these most amazing, like, milky eyes, doesn't he, Ria? He does. They're absolutely gorgeous. They really are. 
if you haven't checked out Shelby Reborn's channel, she's got this honeysuckle witchling baby. That she has um, yellow eyes, and um, she tells a story about this baby that left me just spellbound. I was entranced by it. Now then, I'm going to put this boppy down. Just one second, my treasure, because mummy's got to go and get your bottle. Mummy's got to go and get your bottle. Ugh. Oh, you're such a baby. Excuse me, you've got a nice view of my bum. Apologies for that. <laughs> there we are. Um, just give me one second while I get him set up and then I'm going to feed him two sets. Okay, so I've got his bib on. Excuse me for reaching over him here. Just going to find what I've done with it. Oh, there it is. Okay, sweetie pie, it's coming. Come up on Mama's shoulder. Ah, 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 ah. Gentle, gentle. Don't lunge at the bottle, please. There we go. Yuck. I hate this stuff. There we go, Marcel. That's my precious. There we go. There you go. What a good boy. As you can see, he does not drink your regular formula. <laughs> he has to have something a bit more special. Um, but he likes it, don't you? Eh? You like it. <laughs> there we are. Um, so yeah, I really love the alternative babies. I'm really hoping to get some more. I would love to get, um, I'd love to get an alien, one of the little alien uh, kits, um, the 14 inches long ones. I know that I'm having a manor elf um, fairly soon, the very small one. Um, I forget its name. I do. Th I think I'm going to be having one of those. I can't wait to see it. Can't wait to see it. And I'm also having um, the Klingon, which Nicole is doing for me, and we will make together when she gets over here. Um, that's a homegrown thing because uh, it's an Apple Valley kit, um, and Nicole has sculpted the headpiece, the, the ridges on the forehead, on uh, with Sculpey and baked it on so you can't see any joins unlike my poor little Vashira yeah, more of her and on and um, she's also done his feet is that good? is that good is it? is it good? oh clever boy and um, yeah so but yeah I'd love an alien I'd love a mermaid um yeah, bring, bring him on. And I always I also love a vampire baby. If I can find one that doesn't look... I don't want one with, like, dripping fangs and really horrible looking. Um, I'd like a nice, like, a cute looking one, like Marcella, in the way that Marcella is. He's, he's cute and a bit creepy at the same time. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> um, so... A little bit of news on the Shera, my baby orc, who arrived with these misshapen, not even both uniform ears, which had been just glued on so that you could see a, they looked awful, didn't they? Really? They did. They looked like bits of bacon just stuck to her head, bless her. I know. Um, her artwork was dreadful. She had like fish white skin with way too many black veins. Uh, and her ears, oh, her ears, oh. I really don't know what to do about her, to be honest. Um, there was no chance to send her back to, I mean, it would have cost me more to send her back to America. Um, we don't think we can fix her. Her ears are flat to her head. There's no way of sculpting ears and baking them onto her. I think it's going to be a total loss. I think I'm going to just have to cut shop this one up to experience and it was a very very it wasn't a cheap experience it took me a while to save up for that doll plus the import charges um so yeah you put that one down to experience um it, it, it it's been horrendous nicole is gonna have a look at her when she gets over here and see 
what if anything she can do about the ears because you know, Nicole's a good sculptor um, but oh yeah sad 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 anyways that it's no point being I was angry about it I was really devastated but you can't let things like that kind of sour you I'm not going to be soured I'm gonna think of the wonderful babies I've got basically and I'm going to let this little one go on eating. And I'm actually going to do a burp in a minute because he's been chugging at that quite a while. <laughs> so I'm going to love you and leave you. Um, I shall be back very soon. And until we meet again, we're going to say goodbye. Oh, he's going to deign to give you a wave. That's a good boy. Until we meet again, please take care of yourselves and enjoy your babies, alternative or otherwise. And let's be good to each other. Bye-bye.